supported single leg RDL with a kettlebell. All right, so first thoughts, if you're like, I don't need to support myself to do a single leg RDL, well, you're missing the point. We want to use a heavy kettlebell. That's what the support is. It's going to help us balance. So find yourself next to a rack, post, machine, whatever you need to, to support with. All right, we're going to single leg when we need to the Important, we don't just want to bend at the back for this. We need to use the hip. So lots of tension in that hip as we hinge forward by pushing the hips back and then snap forward. All right, so supported, kettlebell in one hand. You're gonna get heavy on the rooted leg, nice and light on the other leg, and hinge. We're going down slow, slight pause, quick. Slow on the way down is crucial here, right? We're supported on this side to help us hold this heavy weight. So we want to load this Romanian deadlift slowly on the way down, like we do any RDL, because we need the hamstrings to lengthen adequately. And then come up. Great thing about this exercise, you guys can challenge yourself with some explosion, right? So we're contrasting tempos, slow on the way down, but quick and powerful on the way up. So four more reps on one leg, four more reps on the other leg. Um, another option, if it's too challenging, getting that back leg free floating. Remember you can plant one leg, plant that other leg back there lightly, let it be a kickstand for your single leg RDLs here. Same concept, push the hips back, slow, quick. Make sure as you're standing up, you're not trying to stand up with your back, but with your hips, right? So try this one out, draw up the legs, hit the hamstring, it'll definitely work your glutes. That's what we want to feel, right? We're feeling outside of this hip, underneath the glutes. Try it out.